assignment is completed, I cannot leave here. Mm. Madam Jennifer, if there's anything you have done to this young man, I command you to start revealing to us in the mighty name of mm. Jesus. I command you to start revealing to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire, fire. The enemy come to steal, to kill, and to destroy, but God has come to give us life and give us life in abundance. Whatsoever it is that you are not revealing to us this moment, by the reason of this anointing water and for the knowledge of wisdom that has come upon our young prophetess, I command you to begin to expose whatever you have done to this young man. Young man, you use your own eye and see everything that has been happening to you. Madam, the, the longer you keep with holding yourself and confessing, the higher the fire. You did what? I tie you. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'll be my humble self to Mama here once again. It's your one and only to Mama Eke, nobody will know. We are out here on another Young Prophetess assignment, and on today's episode, this young man standing with me is our client, and um, according to our Young Prophetess, she saw a revelation about him, and he's probably in a cage, according to our Young Prophetess, and he needs a lot of liberation. So we are out here, we have been able to locate him. Thank God for divine meeting and everything. So young man, like I said, your case is very, very dicey. And at the same time, it needs a lot of caution to attend to. My young prophetess said I should let you know that you have been involved with a particular lady. Um, what's her name again? Um, Madame Jennifer. Do you know anybody like Madame mm. Jennifer? Like they say they call her Madame Jennifer. Mm, Madame Jennifer, my woman. Your girlfriend, your wife, or? My wife. Your wife? Yeah. The Madame Jennifer we are talking about is your wife. My wife. Yeah, me and she. We know the game, sure. And I know the game. Mm. What's happened? Mm, sure. Nah. What's happened, no, actually? I'm just decided to say, I Wait, when you. I don't understand. You are married to this woman. Yeah, I've been married to this woman. You have been married to her? Yes. So, what actually led to the divorce, or actually led to both of you parting ways? I mm, nah. As a guy, man, stuff. I mean, I just made up my mind, say, I know. You just decided that you want yeah. to abandon her for no reason. Yeah, that's what Apparently, there is something more to this because, according to our young prophet, she said ever since you left her, that both of you are into something. And then, for the fact that you left her, she's angry with you and she has done something to you. Huh. How long have you guys parted with? Well, uh, just six months. Six months ago? Yeah, six months ago. So for the past six months, you guys have not seen each other, mm -hmm. you guys have not spoken? Never seen each other, wow. six months now. So for the past six months, how has life been to you? Oh my shaman. I try also the, you know, they do what, I see say nothing, they work for me, yes. Yeah, they also, they do things for life. I also, I do but I go places, I go office, I go find work. I go give me work. I don't work out, I can shoot care for every hour, I shoot care. So you are, are trying to tell me that ever since you left that woman, your life has just been just miserable. The tumble for me. Everything has now. been going bad for Everything you. Everything just the rough. I think there's a little bit of connection to what our young prophetess have seen about your case. And until you are liberated, you are not going to let you go. So this is it. Eh? I would like you to give me a number. Probably if you contact her, she might not answer you. I but um, I will I'll find her a way. Her number because I blocked her that time. You blocked her. Yeah, but uh, I will still get her number. Sure. You just have to find a way to unblock her. Then let's get access to this woman. Since they say that she is the one involved, I want you to be practically involved with me. Make this you no know, company like say I just come wine you. Yeah, there's a lot of people that we have actually intervened in their cases, and by the grace of God, they have been liberated. And you, as a young man. For the fact that our young prophetess saw in a vision and led me to you on this assignment, that's to show that help has come for you. And until you are liberated, until you are free, we are going nowhere. So you are going to give me a number, let me call her, and then let's see how we can get her out. One way or the other, we are going to find out the truth about the whole scenario. Guys, I I don't know. I've been trying my best to get information from him, but it's not been helpful. I guess the best way for us to find out is to get her this young lady. I don't know. They say they, she's called the Madame Jennifer, and thank God he confirmed to us that he knows this Madame Jennifer. So it will be easier for us to actually meet and then discuss and see how we can liberate the young man from a stronghold if there's any. So for now, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment on this video. Uh, and a very important notice, please, we are not out there scamming people. We don't ask for money. We don't sell 
anointed oil, anointed water, or stops for anybody. And please don't fall for any scammers trying to tell you or coming to your DM to tell you to send money for charity or anything. You can do it out of your own benevolence, but we will not come and categorically ask you to send us money. So please be warned and beware of scammers. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment on this video. Stay with us. Let's get across to this young woman and then see how we can free him from whatever is holding him back. Thank you very much. Yes, yes, okay, good afternoon. Sorry that I have to call you out. It's something mm -hmm. urgent that actually led me to get across to you. You can see me from my office now, then to bring you into this kind of place. No, 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 no. This, uh, I wanted us to see on my own terms. Coming to your office might drag a lot of attentions and um, mm -hmm. unnecessary no crowd. No probably from what you are going to be doing. Mm -hmm. So sorry about it. The whole scenario and the whole reason why I have to call you out because there's a particular young man that has been wanting to see you for a while now. And he has been trying to get across to you, but all to no avail. Okay. That's why I'm having you out. So please bear with me. I would like to go and call him out. I want you to wait for me here. Mm, no okay. Sorry, thank you, ma'am. Uh, Prince Abel, let uh, this boy come out from Oto. Come, 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 come. Is that the madam Jennifer? No, no, no. She did not. She did not. She did not. She did not. What is this one doing here? Now, because of this boy, now you call me. See this one. Because this guy, you know, they fear me. After all, I don't change your life, finish. See, because of this guy, now you go call me. Uh, Come this kind place. No, I don't change hello, your hello, life. Hello, madam, this, please calm this, down. Yes. I would like you to calm down, okay? I would like you to calm down. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Why are you guys not getting annoyed? See, just seeing your husband. Oh, okay, guy, you don't understand. This guy, I mean, what's shine? What's shine in the like this? Now you wash your, now you wash your husband. It's not be anything. Now you not be husband. Who's your husband? I'm a sugar boy now. I'm a sugar boy beside the help. I'm a sugar boy. Who shows my side? They want to be beside your wife. They're crazy. Stop it. They're worried. No, no, madam. It's okay. It's look, okay. It's look okay. Me. It's look me. Look me from up to down. This one, I this one, fit. Take care of me. You, they want to be beside your wife. They're mad. They're crazy. See me. You guys, look me now. This guy want to me. I'm a sugar boy now. Eh? We have we signed an agreement for two years. He go serve me for two years. After one year, you run. Come say make me happy. Come they come serve her. They talk to me. Wait, no. wait, wait, let me get this straight. Ah, James, you never told me this now. Yeah, ma'am, I have to take her as my wife now. How will you, you take someone's wife, wife as your wife? Which kind of wife? You know, I am here for your own liberation and you are here telling me lies. I have been, no wonder I have been trying to get information out of you and you cannot tell me anything straight. Yeah, I'm so she's your sugar mommy. He is my sugar boy. You know what the fear face. You know the fear face. So why are you not telling me that like she's your wife? No, 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 okay, okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Ah. I'm very sorry, ma. Sorry, ma. Ah. You know the fear. They go take people to wow. be your wife. Something they worry for. Eh? You and me are not true. Eh? See this young man. Hmm? Now my old guy driver. No, my old guy can't divorce your me. Now my husband driver. Oh, your husband's driver. Yes. I think he divorce me. Now I'm gonna pick him. You and your husband are divorced now. Yes, we'll be divorced. So you now took over. Yes, your I can't. Man. Yes. To be servicing you. Yes, we both agreed to do that. Two years. Is she lying? After one year, come run. Run, go where now? You can't make me happy. They see this on nonsense face. Ah, ah. This guy will be you that one. Wow. This is a whole lot of revelation. I never got to hear this other part of this whole scenario. So she hired you to service her for two years. After one year of the contract, you left her. Yes, I'm Wow. You leaving her is not a bad thing. Probably you have your reasons why he left her. No, 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 but no, no, madam, no. I seen leave you. You get any way you do this young man because me I know now nah, nah, they even they find out about this kind of relationship when I get. Then he's telling me that you were his wife. Thank God that you came to clarify that he's just your sugar boy. All right, I'm actually on an assignment, and this assignment has um, is employing me to use a lot of wisdom. So I'm very cautious and I'm very I'm very careful how I handle this situation. But right now at this point in time. You are the center of everything. And I would like to get the truth from you. So, madam, I'm asking you, from all sincerity, before God and man, is there anything that you must have done to this young man after he left you? Probably out of anger. I don't do anger. this guy anything. I don't do him anything. Now you wrong me now. Now you leave me wrong. You know, completely. Like a great date. Now so you said, what's going make you leave her wrong? What's going to make her leave me wrong? I know. Follow, you get no, me. follow woman, no, no. they say now nah, she got mommy, all those kind of things. Yeah, I, I get, I get, I get. But at the same time, eh, madam, my young prophetess sent me out on an assignment to come and deliver this young man. And your name, madam Jennifer, is at the front 
of everything happening to him. How long have you guys been part, uh, out of uh, service? It has been long. For some According months. to me, it has been up to six months, yes, right? Yes, so for these six months, months yes. my young prophet has said you have done something to this young man that has warranted his life to be very anyhow. So it is better you tell us what you have done. Let's get a way to solve oh, God, it. Forget this man. Or we are going to find a way to get it out of you one way or the other. I don't get anything was... to do. I don't do anything. Mm. I don't do anything. So you just left him yes. because yes. Sensei may leave you. Yes. yes. You said to Lam. In fact, I said to Lam, I pay him money finish. But I don't want to come and see him again. You don't want to see him again. I don't want to come and see him Madam, again. Madam, add it. Come here, come here. First here. At some point in time, I am sensing a bit of demonic spell around this young man's life. He has been trying to put his life to good use, all to no avail. And, they are, and this prophecy that our young prophet has had is about him to be liberated from your spell. So, madam, if there's anything that you I know about the situation that you're not telling me, start group. letting me know before I, I turn to the other side of it. I don't it. do anything. Do anything you want to do for you. I don't do anything for you. I better shut up your mouth. Who do you want to talk to me, sir? Who do you? Where you come from? You come from Young man, please help me hold this cap. He came from God and you picked him up. Yes. So because he did not service you for two years, what was it that you've done to the young man? I know that. Madam, I will employ you to be very sincere with me. Because one way or the other, we are going to find out anything you must have done to the young man. So I am telling you now, if there's anything you have done to the young man that we need to know about and free him from. Our young prophetess said he should be free from your spell, Madam Jennifer. I know so I am asking you, Madam Jennifer, what is it that you have done to this young man standing beside me? Oh, Daddy, they ask me questions. I don't do anything. Ah. You know, do I have anything? I don't do have anything, I beg. Mm. You know, do I have anything? You know, do I have anything? You know, I pour water for my body. I am out here on an assignment, and until this assignment is completed, I cannot leave here. Mm. Madam Jennifer, if there's anything you have done to this young man, I command you to start revealing to us in the mighty name of mm. Jesus. I command you to start revealing to us in the mighty name of Jesus. Fire, fire. The enemy come to steal, to kill, and to destroy, but God has come to give us life and give us life in abundance. Whatsoever it is that you are not revealing to us this moment by the reason of this anointing water and for the knowledge of wisdom that has come upon our young prophetess, I command you to begin to expose whatever you have done to this young man. Young man, you use your own eye and see everything that has been happening to you. Madam, the, the longer you keep with holding yourself from confessing, the higher the fire. You did what? I tie him. You tie who? Yes, I tie him. I time. You time. You time. Fire. Fire. That fire will keep burning you. That fire will keep burning you. You time. I love that. Because you run away from me. That's why I tell you. You wicked man. After signing the agreement, you just. For two years, you run away. Fire all over my body. So you decided to tie him down as a way to get him back. Why did you tie the young man? Let me know why you tied the young man. Because I don't want him to leave me. You don't want him to leave you. You don't want him to leave you. No job. That is smooth. My body. My head. My leg. All over my body. Untie this young man in the name of Jesus. Begin to untie this young man. Begin to untie this young man. Anything you did to the young man, I command you now to start untying him. Young man, come over here. I don't know why you are running about. It's like you guys don't know how this thing is spiritual. What sort of a wicked woman are you? What sort of a wicked woman are you? Put that thing on the floor. I don't lose that. What sort of a wicked woman? How can human beings be this wicked? My body is burning. What's happening? What's happening to this young man? Fire. All over my body. In the name of Jesus. I said the enemy come to steal, to kill, and to destroy, but he has come to give you life and life abundance. And by the reason of this assignment of our young prophetess, I command life over your spirit, soul, and body in the mighty name of Jesus. From the crown of your head to the sole of your feet, you are free from every bondage in the mighty name of Jesus. You are liberated from anything that has been holding you back, holding your destiny back in the mighty name of Jesus. Young man, are you with me? What happened? Are you with me? What happened to you? Ah, something just come off my body. Something come off for your body. Off my body. You are free in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You are free in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And to you, this woman, you have one chance at life. And that chance is a chance of redemption. Redemption will only come to you if you are ready to confess Christ as your Lord and your personal Savior. I am ready. 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 What are these beats on your hand?